Poya shepherdii is a popular tropical plant that is native to the rainforest of Southeast Asia and is commonly found in the Philippines, Borneo, and Thailand. The plant was named after a British botanist, H. N. Shepherd, who was the first to discover it in the late 19th century. Hoya shepherdii has gained popularity as a house plant due to its attractive foliage and fragrant flowers. Hoya shepherdii is a climbing plant that can grow up to six feet tall. It has succulent leathery leaves that are round or oval shaped and grow up to three inches in diameter. The leaves are dark green with silver variegation and have glossy textures. The plant produces clusters of small star-shaped flowers that are white or pale pink with a sweet fragrance. The flowers bloom in summer and can last for several weeks. Hoya shepherdii is a low-maintenance plant that can thrive in various growing conditions. The plant prefers bright, indirect sunlight and can tolerate partial shade. It needs well-draining soil and should be watered only when the soil is dry to the touch. Overwatering can cause root rot, so it is important to let the soil dry out completely before watering sessions. Hoya shepherdii can tolerate temperatures between 60 and 85 degrees Fahrenheit and prefers a humid environment. It is a slow growing plant and may not need frequent repotting. It can be paired with other tropical plants that require similar growing conditions such as philodendrons, ferns, and bromeliads. It can also be grown alongside other Hoya species to create a stunning display of foliage and flowers. Hoya shepherdii is a Primarily grown as a house plant for its attractive foliage and fragrant flowers. The plant can be grown in hanging baskets or trained to climb a trellis or wall. The flowers can be used for decorative purposes or harvested for their sweet fragrance. In some cultures, the plant is believed to have medicinal properties and is used to treat uh, various ailments. However, it is important to note that the plant is toxic if ingested and caution should be exercised when handling it.